everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Megan. I do sewing, embroidery, and other crafty things. And in today's video, I have a fun unboxing for you guys again. It's another cross stitch company. Um, so I got these from VIPCrossStitch.com. I'll have a link down below as to as well as all the products that I purchased. Um, and I'll also have a discount code that I'll share with you guys too, and it'll also be in the link down below. So yeah, let's get to unboxing. Um, so these kits are actually pretty similar to the kit that I got from AliExpress. Um, pretty much just has like the printed canvas and everything. Um, so I thought I would do an unboxing with you guys so you guys can see their products and hopefully and maybe check them out. So let me open this up. Okay, let's see here. So the first cross-stitched kit that I got is this adorable cross-stitch kit that has some kitties on it. So what this says is that it's a cross-stitch kit that it's a pre-printed canvas and dispensable chart reading. It contains cotton fabric, cotton thread, needle, and the instructions. So here is what this looks like. Um, on the back, it also includes some helpful instructions on how to cross stitch, um, such as how to choose your strands, how to choose your thread color, um, kind of explaining the um, how the unprinted cloth works. Um, but this one, I believe it has the, the pattern printed on the actual cross stitch itself. Um, and then it kind of gives you some important notes on how to kind of take care of it. And then kind of like the cleaning and maintenance part. And then also down there, it also has some helpful stitches as well. So let's open this one up and see what we have. I love that these that comes in these really nice sleeves so everything is nice and organized. So here is the canvas itself. So it's a little tiny one. I just think it's so cute. Um, so you can kind of see the printed canvas. Here's the little kitties and there's a windowsill with some butterflies. And then it also has the thread here. Um, let's see. So it has a thread here and then let's see if there's anything else in here. And I think it also comes with, yeah, so it comes with a uh, the pattern. So not only is it printed on the actual canvas, but it also has a paper pattern. So you can kind of follow the paper pattern if you want, or you can just follow the actual cross stitch itself. Um, so it has um, the different symbols and what they mean, what colors are supposed to be assigned for. Um, knowing that what the different um, terms mean, what the different symbols. So for example, this one has a French knot and a back stitch. And then here is the other half. So you can kind of see the kitties in the window and there is the other half. So very, very cute. So it looks like it really has everything that you will need to complete this project. I'm just gonna kind of put everything back in here. And then we can, um, look at our next uh, cross stitch that we got here. So they have all different sorts of cross stitches that you can get. You can get big ones, you can get little ones like this, and they're very reasonably priced. Um, they also do ship from China. However, it actually got to me fairly quickly from when I ordered, so no complaints about that. So if you're waiting to, if you're trying to figure out what project to do next, a cross stitch would definitely be a good project to work on especially if it's on the printed canvas like this one where you can see those different symbols very easily, then these uh, cross stitches are definitely for you. So there's that one. I'm just going to zip this one up. Okay. This one I actually got for my dad. So it is a really, really cool bass themed um, or fisherman themed cross stitch. So my dad is a really big fisherman and you can see how cute and detailed this one is. So not only do I love how it's on like these plastic sleeves, but um, it's all just, you can easily just throw it in a bag. It doesn't take up much space. Um, so if you're on the go like I am often, then you can easily just grab one of these and bring a project with you. So this one is actually a bigger size. 
So like I said, all of them have a picture of the cross stitch that you'll be working on. And then this one is much bigger than the other one. So here's what this one looks like. Let's see here. Um, yes, so this is how it goes. So this is the top. You can kind of see the fish a little bit in this design. Um, again, like my other cross stitch video, it has the helpful symbol so you can associate the colors with the symbols. And then let's see what this is. I think this is just a picture of it. Yeah, so this one actually has a nice diagram of it. So very easy to fold up and everything. Um, pretty much everything that's on the printed canvas here, like you can see all the different symbols, they're also on the paper form. So if you ever can't tell what a certain stitch is, like what color and everything, you can always double check with your printed um, paper here. And then of course, it includes all of the thread that you will need. So as you can see, this one has a lot of black and just kind of like foresty type colors. And this one also, the colors are all organized for you versus my cross stitch that I got from AliExpress where they weren't and I had to organize them myself. But this one, they already did that for you. So they kind of saved you an extra step. So this one is 40 by 50 centimeters, I believe. Um, so it's fairly big and um, I think it was under $10. I think it was like $8.79 for this big canvas. And like I said, it has really everything that you need. Um, so let me just put this one back and then we can look at our next one because I do have two more. Um, so I tried to find ones that some that were bigger, some that were smaller, just so that you guys can kind of see, um, you know, the comparison between all of them um, and everything like that. Not only do they have non, um, not only do they have like regular pictures like this, but they even have like Disney. I saw Beauty and the Beast. I think I saw the Little Mermaid on there. So they have all different sorts that you can get, all different types of sizes. Um, you could also choose it by thread count. Um, so what thread count means is that um, each project has a th certain thread count. So some projects you'll be using two threads at a time, others you might be using three threads. Um, so usually the ones um, in my case that have um, where you need more threads then you can easily see the stitches better. Um, but it's completely up to you. So let me just fold this one back up and put it away. And then we can look at our next project. This one is really, really cool. So it is, I think this one actually, if I'm remem remembering correctly, I think there was four that you could choose from, but I chose this one. Um, it's like, uh, each one is like a different, like, uh, like seasonal theme. I think this one's, uh, says it's Lavender Girl. So like I said, all of these are in the description below. It looks pretty much the exact same as that first one that we opened up. Um, so it's beautiful cross stitching. Look at all those beautiful colors. So let us open up this one again, or let us open up this one. So I probably won't open the entire thing, but just so you guys can kind of see. Um, so this one um, has all of the colors organized as well. So you can kind of see them laid out there and then their little needle is attached. So that is perfect. So these are all organized for what you will need. Um, and look at all these beautiful, beautiful colors. I'm really excited to do this one. Um, but yeah, so that is that one. I think this one will be very beautiful. Um, and like I said, all of these are very reasonably priced. All right, and then our last one is a sea themed one or it has like um, a lighthouse. If I can put it back into its sleeve so I can show you, okay. So here's a lighthouse. This one is a really good one too. Um, I believe this one, it, it says 22 by 29 centimeters. So it's a little bit smaller, but I think this one is really cute as well. Again, looks like the last one and then the first one that we showed. Again, also has the instructions for cross stitching. I'll show you the canvas. This one looks really nice and colorful. 
So this is a really, this is a really nice one. Um, especially if you, you can just easily like throw it in your purse and do it, you know, um, on your lunch break or, you know, if you're traveling, if you're taking a bus, you know, anytime that you're looking to do a project, you can easily just throw this one in your bag. So this one has a really colorful canvas. Again, you could also see the colors there as well. And then let us look at the thread. So here's all the thread. This one also has a needle. Again, you can see the thread counts on this one, so it checks them off. Um, so this is a 14 count. So that's letting me know that I'll be using two threads. This 11 count here says four threads and the one above that says three threads. So that is the amount of threads that you will be using in a single stitch. So I usually like the two threads because I thread my needle a certain way. Um, and I find that the two thread works best for me, which I'll definitely make a video on how I do that because I saw another YouTuber do it and I thought, why not try it out myself? Um, but yeah, like I said, um, so this one has a ton of colors. So this one has 46 colors. So you can see that and then there are the other colors there. Um, so this one is definitely, you can tell it, it is sea themed and I'm very excited to make all of these cross stitches. So I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video. Um, like I said, those are just a small snippet of the amount of kits that you can get from them. Like I said, they're all very reasonably priced. Each one that I purchased, I will leave a link down below for you guys so you can check it out. And they were also kind enough to give me a discount code for you guys for 7% off. So the code you would use to check out is Megan, M-E-G-A-N-07. So again, Megan07 for the 7% off discount. Um, and yeah, I'm very excited to do these cross stitches. I hope you guys are as well. It's always nice to learn a new skill and hopefully if you guys aren't familiar with cross stitch, you'll learn something from my channel. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.